This all came about because of an idea from Dobbo where, you know, he said, imagine if we could. And uh, a couple of phone calls later, and the whole thing started rolling and it, and it just exploded. You know, obviously one saw the tribute video to Johnny Clegg a few years ago, which was very powerful. So I thought, you know, at the start, we could just enjoy something like that, but it's become much bigger, much deeper than we thought. You're either doing this half-heartedly or you're doing it 100%, or we're doing this 110%. I'm a vocal producer. I take choirs and try and make them sound amazing. I take artists and make them sound international. Um, so, so, you know, hearing about this, I thought, well, this is amazing. This is a serious challenge. That the wind has blown away. Yes! That's exactly what I wanted. Okay, I knew you could do that, man. We started with some very awkward auditions that we had to do in front of uh, RJ and their team, um, which I thought brought maybe the best and worst singers out. <laughs> I mean, Stephen Kitzhoff, Sia Kulisi, Tio Bella Sanatla, you know, Herschel Janchis. And to see them as top athletes suddenly come out of their comfort zone and get challenged and then deliver and want to be more involved, it, it's absolutely heartwarming. So we sing Osieza after a game, after we've, we've won. Um, I think it's something different. I think it speaks to, to who we are um, and, and what we want to try to achieve um, with the song. Um, I think Johnny Clegg himself was a symbol of hope in South Africa, um, which obviously Dobbo, our coach, has taught, taught, told us all about. It's about let's all sing together and really get power. And what's wonderful is it's translated into our team's winning song. So if we win, we sing it in the change room song. And that's basically it. Oh my God, how fun. And then, I mean, obviously you guys can sing the chorus together. The song is almost like another national anthem. You know, Johnny Clegg has written more than one national anthem for, for the country. So I'm, as, as a patriot, always there for it. If you sing in a group and with these amazing artists, it's the same as a rugby team. You've got a couple of guys who may be senior players or star players, but they still got to fit in in what the team is doing and they got to lead and we're going to be led today by the musicians. So yeah, I mean, I, I suppose the question first and foremost is, can you, can you sing where Johnny sing? Let's just try. Can't shine in a downtown bar. You can nice. sing it. Nice. 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 Sound. Sound straight. Sound. sound. Yeah. Easier for you. Uh, when I got the email, I was uh, tried not to jump around in happiness because I'm a huge Stormers fan. Obviously, playing in Johnny Clegg's band for my rugby team to want to do a Johnny Clegg song was just the perfect, uh, you know, I think I was definitely the guy for the job because I know a lot of great musicians, but not a lot of great jazz musicians who as into Stormers rugby as I am. I personally got to spend some time with my one of my heroes from a young age, uh, Francois van Koch. So to be able to be in, the, in a recording studio with him was something that I'll remember for a long time. <laughs> I think like playing music and playing rugby, there's a lot of things that go hand in hand. You have to work together, you know, that you're like part of a team, you're working for the greater good of everyone together. It's like exactly the same in a, in a band as, as in a rugby team. And I think it also brings people together. If you can sing a song together, I think your connection is deeper. You can see everyone's working together. There's a lot of laughing and stuff inside, but yeah, it's all together. It's such a special, Thing and obviously what it stands for and yeah, it's, it's really awesome to be here. I'm born and bred Cape Townian um, and Newlands is Cape Town, the Stormers is Cape Town and this is an amazing opportunity to get close to a rugby team. You know, I've prayed about this for years and, and God answers prayer. I've got a comedian and a rugby player. <laughs> and then you've got Jamie Roberts who's come from Wales. And he's had to sing it, you know, and he doesn't understand Zulu at all. Yeah, I, th I think rugby and singing have gone hand in hand for, for a long time. Uh, not just for supporters, but for players as well. You know, you'll often be part of teams or sing in the change rooms or sing on the team bus. Uh, and it's a great way of uniting a group. Certainly as a Welshman, it's uh, something we, we're hugely proud of ourselves on, uh, uh, is, our, is our singing and vocal ability. So. Swollen eyes, Swollen eyes. He sways and he smiles, cos no one can't put him down. I absolutely love Coach Dobson's mentality as far as, you know, the well-being of, of his players first and foremost, and then also the philosophical meaning that he's attached to this particular initiative is, is one that I just couldn't say uh, no to being involved in. Uncomfortable in the beginning, um, but then really late on when you started singing, the nerves started dying and I, I really enjoyed it. Nail breaking, I'm still sweating, but it was nice. Leaving the rugby boots to, to hold onto a mic, it's definitely an incredible experience seeing these guys in their natural element and um, 
hearing the voices up close. It's, it's incredible and uh, eye-opening experience, definitely. What do you think of Steven's voice here? I think he's got a lovely voice. I was telling the guys now, when I close my eyes, I could like see rainbows and, and just flowers around. She's got a beautiful voice. You know the tide is turning. Make my crossing. <laughs> yes, this is amazing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Taking them and putting them in, in, in situations where maybe they're a little out of their comfort zone, but also um, getting them together with professional musicians and people who really know what they're doing and giving them that, that life experience. And, you know, so far it's turned out to be just the most incredible experience for everybody. <laughs>